Well, I've had 24 hours of high winds and there's snow and we're stuck here in Camp Move inside a little Transit Connect van and it's not really built out. And we're going to try to make some brownie cookies or something. I don't know. I don't have vegetable oil, but I have olive oil, I have an egg, I have water, and I have fudge brownie mix. Let's see what we can come up with. Oh, I don't have a spoon, and this is my bowl. Okay, I need a half an egg, but here's one egg. Here's some olive oil and I'm going to add a few tablespoons of water and stir with my knife. Got it stirred up. Ready's ready and waiting for any treats if he can get them but of course he can't have any because this is chocolate. Poor Riley. Can you imagine living a life without chocolate and without brownies? So we're heating up the pan. You know I don't know what I'm going to do when it gets near done because all I have is a knife and I don't want to scratch up the pen. We'll see what happens. I hope I don't burn it. I've turned off the heat. <laughs> it's been around 12 minutes. I think it's probably done enough that I can test it. I just remembered I had a package of nuts. I could have put in this. I'll put it in the other half. Well, I should have used a half an egg. More egg makes it more cake-like, so it's kind of a cross between a little bit chewy and a little bit cake-like. But it's a success. Yum. It's good. Okay, we have the second one going. I couldn't find my nuts, but anyway, so we're going to see how long this takes. I've got it set for 12 minutes, and then I'll check on it. I have to keep adjusting that and turn it off a, a little bit in between so it can bake so it doesn't burn the bottom. Second one. This one's a little thicker. I must have had more of the mix in this one than the other one. Looks good. Tastes good. You ought to try it. It took about 12 minutes cooking in my skillet. I know it's brownies, but they're cake-like brownies, and I thought I'd try it with some organic raspberry spread. Mmm. It's really good.